That's really rad. Like if I wasn't married, I'd get that tattoo. My wife would hate me if I got anything like that. That is so cool. Does your wife hate spiders? No, she just doesn't want me to get a face tattoo. She says I'm too handsome. <laughs> the best time of the year. I love it. It's my favorite holiday. I fucking love Halloween. Oh my god, Halloween's such a cute, like, quaint holiday. It's like the the whole time of the year where I start perking up, and I'm just like, oh, I'm friendly. Hello, everyone. How's it going? Do you guys want to go and get some pumpkin spice lattes? What's up? Do you guys have holidays? I'm always working. <laughs> yeah, wow. since, since you do everything. <laughs> Shut the hell up. <laughs> Halloween, I think, is cool. You know, I've always loved Halloween. Definitely not as much as I used to when we were like you know, yeah. young, young adults. But when we were young adults on Halloween in the Bronx, we used to get that shit up. lit. Like the next day, you might just still get destroyed because the person you just egged. Oh, uh, egging. Might That's wanna... not a thing anymore. That was f***ing cool. Well, eggs cost like a million dollars nowadays. <laughs> you throw an egg at me, I'm trying to catch it. <laughs> Put it in my pocket. <laughs> Make breakfast with that shit. <laughs> Ooh, oh my god, the realistic neck spider. Those are classics. That's done well. Look at that drop, the shadow, the man. The drop shadows. Yeah, nice. that's dope. Oh, that's fucking sick. I love that placement and the shadows. Boom, who did that? Good job. It's a good tattoo, whether it's Halloween or not. I mean, it, it looks dope. I like that one because it's big enough to where, like, you know it's not a real spider. Like, sometimes, like, with the shadow and stuff, it's like, ooh, I would see that and, like, want to smack your neck to be like, oh, my God, you got a bug on you, babe. How do you feel about spiders? I'm not a fan, but I like tattoos of spiders. I think they're really f***ing rad. I think they should live. I try to <laughs> catch them. Put them outside because they kill. Them me. Yeah, they kill mosquitoes. That shit is cool. I like spiders. I, they don't bother me. I step on them. And what? We have a tarantula in the shop. Uh, her name is Shiva. She is a what? Ch Chilean rosehair. She's about 13, 14, give or take. She's pretty long. But spiders overall, I don't really f with them, which is interesting because she sits right next to my station. It's kind of like seeing your own mortality. You know. Oh man, that's a thing that you can definitely do. This I would definitely get. Love it. Need that. I'm, I'm no comment. I'm trying not to shame right now. See, like when I see people like this on the street, I just know you're just probably like a funny guy. Like, If anybody had that, I'd probably be their friend. Or more. Yeah, yeah. I want to like drink a beer with him. I don't imagine seeing this in person though, like being in line at McDonald's and- mm -hmm. What gas station is he at? I don't know, I'm looking in the background and I'm like, were they like, was he getting like his oil changed or something? He's sitting in the booth with somebody. Yeah. I think he's at Waffle booth. House. Yeah, if you just had the tattoo on the back of your head, that's fine, that's all good. But when you start to accessorize the tattoo on the back of your head- <laughs> Do you think I'm, this man is giving your mustache a run for a time? Not at all. <laughs> I would have taken that picture. <laughs> that's a cool sleeve. Like a bunch of Friday the 13th tattoos. Wow. That's like a Friday the 13th sleeve on, yep. on that's steroids. Like, yep. That's incredible. That's they went to they went to the Halloween special for sure. Like, yo, fill me up. A totem pole of evil people. I would, I would have talked them out of it, to be honest with you. I would have said, look, just get one Freddy Krueger big, <laughs> and then we'll do fucking Chucky on the bottom. So this is what I would think like a Gen Z type of tattoo would be, like almost like super stickery and stuff like that. But that's what's in style nowadays. Yeah. That's, yeah. Oh, for sure. That's the fad, minimalist, bunch of little tattoos. Is it in one sit sitting? Oh, that's mine. This is actually one of my favorite projects I ever did. And she was like, I want it done like now. Uh, so we did it in three sessions. And there was like a couple cover ups in there too, which I thought was pretty cool. I want to do more of those. Like if I could do those every day, I would be so happy. A chromatic scream. I mean, 
That's dope. I fucking love it. That's so sick. It's definitely spooky. Uh, so that's a that's a win. Looks pretty good. Not too bad. Oh, that's nice. I would like to see how it heal. I really wish that the that the outline on the outer was a thick and just gnarly black. 14 round. You, but... <laughs> needs black. It needs black, man. There's like no black in this tattoo. You if got it... those white stars. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if this tattoo had some black in it, it would actually be on the money. It's pretty close to there. Because a lot of light, light, light colors, like light blue, white colors. But this cream is still great. Yeah. Aside from the white stars, I wouldn't mind the no black in the tattoo if it had a bolder outline. That you mean a weak. black outline? <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> I have, I think, when I, like a long time ago, my ex was obsessed with him specifically, so I, I saw a lot of him. Yeah, I, I don't know. There's not much I can say about that. It's a cool tattoo, though. How was your ex obsessed with him? Like, how do you know? Like, what would you Because. It, it like became him. Like it was like. Oh. <laughs> I always think of Michael Scott when he talks about. I feel like Nev Campbell in Scream Two. She just wants to go to college and be with her friends, and then the murderer shows up and just ruins her life. Learned a lot of lessons from that movie. <laughs> this is sick. <laughs> That is an interesting Halloween tattoo. It's fucking weird, but funny at the same time. <laughs> love. I don't know what it is, but hot. <laughs> hot. Yeah, love it. Uh, yeah, the heels? Yeah, I love it. Fire. That is sexy. It's giving. I don't know. It's very in our generation, I think. Yeah, I enjoy looking at this tattoo. It's fun. It's not meant to be serious. It doesn't even need to be perfect. It's just a fun tattoo and I dig it. Yeah. Is this a, is this big boy pinups? <laughs> I love his work. I worked with him at a Three Kings five years ago. He's so rad. I love his work. That's, I would expect nothing less. I used to like it when I was 10, but you know, when you start paying bills, like every day is every day is valuable. You know, every day is crucial. You gotta make that make that spread. You know, like bills ain't getting cheaper. You know what I mean? What's but, what is related to Halloween? I, I, I was just gonna I say. Don't <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know a tangent. I don't know. I don't know on a tangent. Okay, okay. How does paying your bills correlate to your distaste for Halloween? That's, I mean, okay. I mean, you know. Halloween tattoos. Yeah. Um, I don't know, uh, I don't know, I went off. Just tell us that you love Halloween. <laughs> yeah, Halloween is great. I'm holding this empty cup. Uh, you can put it down. Yep, yep. Hey. That's fine. Sure. Mm -hmm. Why not? Whoopsie.